Have you ever been stuck at a traffic light for what seemed like a really long time? At the University of Florida Transportation Institute, we are looking for innovative ways to shorten these delays and also to make intersections safer using new and emerging technologies. Typically, traffic lights detect the arrival of a vehicle with a loop detector in the pavement. This detector sends a message that triggers a green light at the next opportunity. Today, however, we can collect many different types of data using cameras, radar, and LIDAR. These sensors are located inside the car as well as within the infrastructure. At UF, we have developed the Real-Time Intersection Optimizer, or RIO, that uses all of this data to determine the position of each vehicle and estimate when it will reach the intersection. With this data, RIO can send information to the traffic signal to control how long the red and green light phases should last, resulting in a shorter wait time. In the future, this technology could also help vehicles move through an intersection without stopping. More and more vehicles are what we call connected because they can communicate with other cars and the world around them. Your GPS system is an example of being connected. It gathers information through cellular signals and recommends the fastest route to your destination. New technology is also allowing vehicles to become more autonomous, meaning they can operate without a human driver. Some new cars have autonomous technology features, such as self-parking, autonomous emergency braking, or adaptive cruise control, ACC. With the real-time intersection optimizer, we are building a way for traffic signals connected vehicles and automated vehicles to communicate with one another. This means that cars and their drivers could be alerted to an upcoming change in signal. Our app will tell drivers the optimal speed to safely adjust their trajectory to the signal. Simulation implementing our algorithm shows a 38 to 52 percent reduction in average travel time compared to conventional actuated signal control. While the RIO is still in the test phase, we anticipate that it will help reduce congestion delays and improve safety for all drivers in the future.